feeling so exhausted i went to sleep at around like 12 but i couldn't fall asleep until maybe two so i was literally just like tossing and turning in bed for a good two hours so that's great anyways i'm going to head out right now I'm wearing the same thing from yesterday so just wearing my nike cap and then this windbreaker this windbreaker is from yes style and then black tank and then black jeans i'm gonna have to grab one of these today finished getting ready for the day i'm heading out at around three right now it's almost one um, i'm heading out to film a group video project essentially for our video subject we're going to be interviewing a person that's in our program that is a part of a dance group on campus so today we will be filming the interview portion and then also getting some b-roll hopefully and then tomorrow is when we'll be filming their performance at renison so right now i'm just trying to figure out exactly what kind of equipment we need um we wanted to get a lav mic for the audio but we ended up not being able to send one out from the stratford campus so the next best thing is to probably use like an iphone mic all we have to work with so that's what's happening watching whaley's vlog right now i'm really sad about the fact that they don't have the black like perversion urban decay razor sharp eyeliner on sephora anymore i don't know what happened to it did they discontinue it i'm not sure but this is like the only type of eyeliner that i use because it gives you like the sharpest lines and it doesn't smudge as much in comparison to other eyeliners that i've used before so this is honestly like my holy grail eyeliner so just getting ready and then gonna have lunch then head out for the day all right amazon unboxing can i open this without scissors first thing that i got was some toner because i ran out of the one that i'm currently using right now so basically just got the same one that i always use this is witch hazel and this is the rose petal scented one and then okay this is for pip our hamster but basically his water dispenser broke so we had to get another one i will figure this out later and so this is like the only cleanser that I use and I was running out of this as well so I got it again so basically this was just like a little restock package in a way along with the thing for our hamster 
I have a little documentary series recommendation for you guys. So recently I started watching the Netflix original show called Losers and I am 100% obsessed with it. It's a sports documentary that um, showcases different episodes with different athletes and the whole theme of the show is to showcase people that have went through a really rough patch in their life and career and how they basically turn that into even greater success or not even just success in terms of like you know fame and like fortune but also just finding themselves and realizing a bunch of things that they never would have realized before if it wasn't for the failure that they faced and i'm in love with this show i think it's amazing and it brings forward a bunch of amazing messages i haven't watched all of the episodes yet but the one that i enjoyed the most out of all the ones that i've seen so far is probably episode three judgment and this one was just about um, a figure skater called Surya Bonnelly and you guys should definitely watch it I'm not gonna spoil anything so you have to go check it out hi would you like to tell the story of your airpod I got an airpod case but the airpod case looked like a because it was great and I lost it on the street. Okay, that is Becca's AirPod story. Thanks for tuning in. You're this is my misery in the process. <laughs> no, I will not monetize. No, I should monetize this video so we can put it towards your AirPod. <laughs> this is the food that we prepped yesterday at midnight. So we got green beans and really bad looking butter chicken. <laughs> Wait, um, did you go with energy? kind of rough with my blanket. I'm like, this is that. Wait. Stop. Is this white or is this cream? It's cream. This is white. White is this. I cannot see this. See? Oh, Damn, you proved me not wrong a there. Design. Okay. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, just come in when you can. Like a work session. Wait, so you're just gonna be here? Yeah. I know. Gallon's gonna do tomorrow's shift though, and I'm doing Friday, so let's chill. But why is there only like one, two, three, four, five, six? Why is there only six? Why is there only six shrimps? So oh, closer. Closer. Ah. Uh, Next one. Oh, a gimbal who you know. <laughs> who needs a gimbal? Tour guide. Okay, okay, go, go, go. Is anyone there? Like we're working. But we are working. We're filming a video of campus, and since we don't have a gimbal, we need you. Okay, okay. Okay. This is Hagey Hall. Tired. Show us the computer lab. So this is the finances computer lab. People come here and, and do numbers, I think. This is what this looks like. Oh, gosh, Ooh, it's like all rolling. Empty. Ooh, look at this shot. It's so smooth. Oh, is that the end? Do I reach the end? <laughs> it's like a workout. That is the little. What is that? The cafe. That's the cafe that's open for like two hours a day. <laughs> this is the elevator. This is the cafe again. Is there anything down here? Nope. Oh no. Our, that's a goose. Oh, that's but cute. It's a rock. Now we gotta go back in. Okay, thank you for coming to our tour. Join us next time. What's our next spot that we're gonna explore? <laughs> the <Seven. laughs> Come back. <laughs> oh, she looks so happy.
You get to eat. Buffalo chicken. <gasps> Whoa. Ooh. And then Panda was doing it. Hey, <laughs> stop this. You didn't get a pickle? I love getting the pickle with it. It's actually really good. I, I never get it pickle on the side. They just put it. No, they just put it on the side. There's no space. Excuse me, Condescender. No, you just don't.